Welcome friends, uh, in this video we will be talking about a uh, simple type of mutation, DNA mutation which is called uh, transitions and transversions. Now this transition and transversion both of them are uh, fall in the category of point mutation. Now what we mean by point mutation, a point mutation means uh, when uh, any change in DNA happens into a particular nucleotide sequence instead of a whole region of DNA is called the point mutation. That means uh, if we, we are taking this whole DNA and there these are the nucleotides then we can say each of the nucleotide uh, uh, nucleotides are single points. Now any mutation on those nucleotides will be called the point mutation. Now in this case, uh, in this case what we are having, we are having uh, arrangement of nucleotides like T always pair with A, C with G and all these things are going on but uh, if any changes in this uh, nucleotide pairing happens or base pairing happens here uh, that will be called uh, this transitions and transversions point mutations. Now what are called transition and what are called transversions? Now we know there are two different type of bases in DNA one is the purine basis another one is the pyrimidine basis now those purine bases are adenine and guanine and the pyrimidine bases are thymine and cytosine. Now adenine pairs with thymine and guanine pairs with cytosine. This is the basic rule. Now if uh, purine is replaced by a purine and a pyrimidine is replaced by a pyrimidine uh, then it is called a transitions type of point mutation and if a purine is replaced by a pyrimidine and a pyrimidine is replaced by a purine then it is called the transversional uh, mu mutation. Okay, so here is the example. Now we are having T pairs with A, that means a pyrimidine purine pair. Now, uh, like I have said, a pyrimidine will be replaced by a pyrimidine to have a transition. So here T was there. Now, if T is replaced with C, as you can see here, and A instead of A, it, it is replaced with G, which is another purine. So here we can see this py pyrimidine is replaced by another pyrimidine and a purine is replaced by another purine that's why it is called the transitions because the replacement is done uh, by the same type of uh, basis okay that's why it is called the transitions now in the transversion what we are having if a pyrimidine is replaced by a purine and a purine replaced by the pyrimidine right now here what we are having T which is uh, a pyrimidine is replaced by A which is a purine and here A which is a purine is replaced by uh, pyrimidine which is T right so that's why uh, here what we can see uh, the replacement is done uh, utilizing the different type of or uh, using the different type of bases that's why we call them the transversion type of point mutation okay so these are the differences in transition purine pu uh, replaced purine pyrimidine replaced pyrimidine and transversions purine replaced by pyrimidine pyrimidine, re pyrimidine replaced by the purine Okay, that's it. And this kind of point mutation can uh, pro make different problems. Uh, like you can say, Th this uh, this type of mutations happen during the replication stages when any uh, wrong incorporation of the base happens, or sometimes base is changed uh, via some type of chemical modifications. For example, the guanine is changed utilizing an oxo; uh, it, it is converted into an 8-oxo guanine, and all this type of uh, changes is happening. Like the like like uh, cytosine if cytosine is methylated or uh, 5 uh, prime is methylated then it is converted into uracil now this uracil will pair with a as we know instead of g so what we'll have we end up with a uh, ua instead of cg okay so this kind of uh, mutations can also happen in this case so it's a uh, transition type of mutation can happen right so these are the examples of uh, this side of mutations and i hope it will help you thank you